Osage Stadium, Lafayette, Indiana, the football field and stadium of the Purdue University Football Club. Notre Dame and Purdue are playing in a game that means a lot to both ball clubs. Purdue lost the first game of the season to Missouri. Notre Dame won from Oklahoma. There's a shot at the interior of the stadium. 50,000 people are on hand. Temperature 86 degrees, not a cloud in the sky. A real warm afternoon. Now, around the running tracks, surrounding the field, they have the floats on many of the top games Purdue plays during the year. This is another example of the floats and the imagination of the fraternities and sororities on campus. They get a real kick out of it, have a lot of fun with it. Here are the young cheerleaders coming out in front of the ROTC band of Purdue University. It's a crack band and it's a crack ROTC unit at Purdue. These are the baton swingers out in front of the band. Here comes the Notre Dame football club. Assistant coach McBride, the first young man out. And there's the ball club moving through. Guglielmi, number three, to quarterback. Carey, number two, is his assistant quarterback. As they file by, and now the Purdue University team comes bouncing onto the field, preparatory to the kickoff. Notre Dame takes calisthenics. All players in tip-top shape for today's game. Purdue University co-captain, Schmalling, number 38. Evans, other co-captain and quarterback, number 16. Penza, Notre Dame's captain, number 83, goes down for a forward pass in practice before the game. Shannon, likewise, number 33, goes down and takes a pass. There's Frank Leahy on the left, coach of Notre Dame, Stu Holcomb on the right, coach of Purdue University. They're talking over the new rules in football, the one platoon system. Co-captains and captains out on the field with the referee flipping the coin. Notre Dame wins the toss and elects to kick off. Penzer shakes hands with Evans and Schmalling. Now the boys will get ready to line up for the kickoff. There's the last huddle for Purdue and the final huddle for Notre Dame before the first play of the game. Frank Leahy giving final instructions just before the kickoff. Mavridis kicks off for the Fighting Irish. Fine kick into the end zone. Taken by Zembo, who returns to the 17-yard line before Warden makes a shoestring tackle. First and ten to go now for Purdue on their own 17-yard line. That's a backward pass from Evans to Schmalling. Schmalling cuts off the left side of his own line and moves for 16 yards before he is stopped by Heap on the 33-yard line. Evans goes back to pass. Running far off to his right. Let's it go! And it is broken up by Warden. A nice defensive play on the part of Warden. Purdue will be forced to go into punt formation. Brock is deep. He takes the pass from center. He gets the kick away. It's not too good a kick, however, as it rolls dead at midfield, the 50-yard line. And it is Notre Dame's ball for the first time today. First and 10 at the 50. There's a backward pass to Heath, number 42. He swings wide for four yards before he is toppled. Guglielmi goes back to throw. He's poised, he's ready, he throws, and Heap grabs it down to the 38-yard line of Purdue. It's a first down at that point. That's Warden carrying the ball for the first time this afternoon. He goes for seven. Guglielmi on the spot pass to Penza. Beautifully executed play. First down on the 15-yard line. Well, here the Notre Dame attack bogs down. It's now fourth down. And Notre Dame will try a field goal from the 23-yard line. Mavridi's kick is through the uprights for three points. And Notre Dame leads Purdue three to nothing. Mavridi's again kicks off for Notre Dame. Zimbo has it in the end zone once more. Brings it out to the 19-yard line where he meets Hunter head on. Evans gives the ball to Keller. Keller fumbles and Heap recovers for Notre Dame on the Purdue 29-yard line. Notre Dame's ball first and 10 to go. 
Here's a shot in the field, a very excellent shot. Yuliami flips it over to Latner. Latner swings for 12 yards down to the 13-yard line of Purdue before he is finally knocked off his pins. Slow motion, Yuliami to Warden. Warden moves to the 10. He cuts at the 8. He battles at the 5, breaks the tackle at the 2, and goes into the end zone, standing up for the touchdown. Notre Dame now leads 9-0. Brady's will try for the 10th point. Giuliani holding. The kick is good. Score 10 to nothing. Notre Dame over Purdue. First quarter. Brady's will kick off for the Irish. Peters grabs it in the end zone. Comes out to the 5. 10, 15, 20, 23 yard line. First and 10 to go. Purdue's ball on their own 23. Evans goes back to pass. He hits Wojciechowski for a fine gain on the play and a first down at the Purdue 40-yard line. There's a backward pass to motion. He's hit by Shannon for a four-yard loss. Evans goes back to pass. He hits Molshan. Who fumbles the ball, but the ball goes out of bounds. Purdue was the last to touch the ball. It's Purdue's ball on their own 47-yard line. But here, Purdue's attack bogs down, and they'll be forced to go into punt formation. Neves is back to kick. Williami in the safety position calls for a fair catch on the Notre Dame 27-yard line. Notre Dame's ball, first and ten to go. Carey now in the quarterback picks up 10 yards as he carries the ball himself on the keeper play. Q is now in at fullback. Washington is halfback for Notre Dame. Carey at quarter. McHugh fumbles going over the middle. Washington recovers for Notre Dame on the Purdue 42. Carey gives the ball on the backward pass to Fitzgerald. Fitzgerald cuts outside. Follows his blockers nicely. Swings across the chalk marks. Moves all the way down to the nine-yard line of Purdue before he is stopped. The end of the first quarter. Notre Dame leads Purdue by a score of 10 to nothing. Giuliani. Flips the ball to Heap. Heap goes for nine yards, into the end zone, but a clipping penalty nullifies the touchdown. Ball moved back to the 20-yard line. That was the first play of the second quarter. The break lost the touchdown on the clipping penalty. Now, this play is in slow motion. Yuliami moves to the left. Looks as if he may run with the ball. Just at the right time, he jumps high into the air. Passes quickly to Latner. Warden's in front throwing the block uh, very effectively. And Latner picks up 10 yards on a well-executed play. Down to the 10-yard line. Guglielmi hangs onto the ball himself. The Notre Dame loses the ball on downs. And Purdue takes over first and 10 to go. Evans back to pass. Meant for Murakowski, incomplete. Brock back to punt, gets the kick away from his own goal line. Joe Heap grabs it, fakes to Latner, and is hit by Wilshire Howitz. And the Purdue 44. Notre Dame leads 10 0, second quarter. Guglielmi goes back to throw. Passes to Heap along the sidelines. Heap has it at the 34. He's down to the 30. He cuts to the 27, moves to the 25. Nice play on the part of Heap. A good pass by Guglielmi. Notre Dame moving. Latner carrying for six more yards down to the 19-yard line before Schmaling made the tackle. Guglielmi goes back to throw it. He hits Shannon for a 13-yard gain and a first down, down to the Purdue 11-yard line. <laughs> Drew 
Guglielmi goes back to pass. He's hit and fumbles. Kerr recovers for Purdue. On the 25-yard line of Purdue. Second quarter. Evans at quarterback goes back to pass. He spots Kerr downfield. He hits Kerr on the dead run at the 45. Kerr's at the 30, 25, the 20, 15, the 10. Kerr goes into the end zone. A 75-yard pass play for the touchdown. And Purdue is in the thick of the fight. Scores 10 to 6. Reichert tries the extra point, and it's good. The score is 10 to 7. Notre Dame 10, Purdue 7. Reichert kicks off for Purdue. Lattner grabs it on his own 14-yard line, comes back to the 20. Follows his blockers at the 25 to 30, 35 to 40, 45, 50, 45, 40. He may go all the way. He's at the 30, the 25, the 20. He scores standing up. A tremendous return of 86 yards for a touchdown on the kickoff. A real thrill. Latner All-American and Maxwell Club winner last year. One of the great stars of 1952, a star again in 53. Avridis makes it 17 for Notre Dame, 7 for Purdue. Avridis kicks off for the Irish. Mr. Jansen of Purdue takes on his own four. Fumbles on the 25-yard line. Rettinger recovers and advances to the Purdue 39. at the helm goes back to throw looks downfield Giuliani streaks in to intercept the ball he was very depressed that he had fallen down but he certainly did a great job in defense intercepting the ball on the Notre Dame 39 yard line Latner has it number 14 looks like Latner may go all the way again but he tripped over his own ankle and fell on the 42 yard line of Purdue 15 yard game Warden over the middle this time. Neil Warden, watch him cut back. Great leg power, tremendous drive. Takes the ball down to the Purdue 32-yard line. And there again, Notre Dame's attack bogs down, and Mavridis will be called on on fourth down to try a field goal. Poised and ready. This is in slow motion. And the kick was wide. Purdue takes over on their own 20-yard line. Evans goes back to pass. Number two, Carey, in at quarterback on defense. Intercepts for Notre Dame. Curry made the tackle on the Purdue 45-yard line. Q hits the middle of the line for five yards. That's Fitzgerald carrying. He swings for nine around right end. First half almost history. Notre Dame leading 17 to 7. Getting ready for the halftime activity. Carries in there at quarterback. Only seconds remaining. There's a backward pass to Washington. And Washington finds daylight and really moves. All the way down to the 10, the 5, the 4, the 3, the 2, the 1. He's in for the touchdown. Washington scores. Brown will try the extra point this time. He misses it. And Notre Dame leads by a score of 23 to 7. The end of the first half, Notre Dame has a long lead. There's a shot of the Purdue band at halftime, putting on 
A wonderful demonstration. And here's the kickoff that starts the third quarter. McBreedy's kicks off for Notre Dame. Jansen grabs on the six. Brings it out 25 yards. Fumble. Recovered. Evans back to pass. Evans is looking pretty good with his passing right now. Smalling fumbles. Recovered by Warden on the Purdue 19-yard line. Warden, that's the second fumble that Warden has been in on today. Warden playing top flight football. Guglielmi in at quarterback. He gives the ball to the fullback Warden. And Warden cracks over the middle for seven yards. Latner fumbles. Zembo recovers on the Purdue 14-yard line. Purdue's ball. Shot from the field. Evans passes on the dead run to Schmalling for five yards to the 18. Third down. There goes Schmalling over the middle. He's gaining momentum. Full steam ahead. Looks like Schmalling has a chance for a touchdown, but he's pulled down from behind by Gulyami on the Notre Dame 37-yard line. Nice play for Purdue and Schmalling. Evans at quarterback number 16, co-captain of Purdue, goes back to pass. He throws a beauty downfield. And it's taken on the dead run by Brock for a touchdown. But hold it, hold it. Penalty, touchdown nullified by a holding penalty. The ball goes back. The Purdue 43-yard line. Look at Coach Holcomb. He is really depressed. The break. Evans fumbles and it's recovered by Captain Penza of Notre Dame on the Purdue 42. Guglielmi goes back to pass. He's got great protection. Throws to Joe Heap for a first down on the Purdue 11-yard line. A 31-yard gain. Latner drives for five. Down to the five. Hard to stop. Second down. In slow motion. Guglielmi moves. Look at the way he changes direction. Does a full pivot. Moves through the line. And goes over for the touchdown. for the extra point to make it if he makes it Notre Dame 30 Purdue 7 both teams are set there's the snap there's the kick the kick is perfect Notre Dame 30 Purdue 7 and the Breedies kicks off again for Notre Dame Kerr grabs it in the end zone Comes out to the 16-yard line where he is hit hard by Heap. Purdue's ball first down. Evans goes back to toss. Hunter follows him and drops him for a loss back to the 9-yard line, a 6-yard loss. And Purdue fails to gain, and so it's fourth down, and Neves goes back to punt. Gets off a very shallow kick that goes out of bounds on the Purdue 17 yard line. Notre Dame's ball first and ten. Guyami passing to Shannon. Complete. Seven yards to the Purdue 10 yard line. Warden goes around right end. He's at the 10, the 5, the 4. He's over for a touchdown. He can really carry that football. Brady's will try for the 37th point for Notre Dame. Giuliani holding. Placement kick is perfect. Notre Dame 37, Purdue 7. 
that is the end of the third quarter. Evans goes back to pass. The high pass downfield, broken up. Gerald broke it up. Evans again going back to pass. And he's thrown for a loss. Seven yard loss. Brock back to punt. He lifts the kick downfield. To Fitzgerald. But Fitzgerald will be run out of bounds if he doesn't cut. He is run out of bounds on the 33 yard line of Notre Dame. Notre Dame draws a 15-yard penalty for holding. Balls on their own 25-yard line. That's Washington, number 41, with the old apple. He's moving for 16 yards to the Notre Dame 41-yard line before he is toppled to the turf. Now the Notre Dame attack fails to function, and it's fourth down again. McHugh will kick this time for the Irish. There's the kick. Brock takes it and returns 23 yards to the Notre Dame, 47 yard line. Nice return by Brock. 37 to seven the score, Notre Dame leads. Gutman now in the quarterback for Purdue. Number 14, slow motion shot. He's looking, he's passing for 17 yards to Quilhot. Grabbed it on the 39, takes it to the 35, moves down to the 31 before he is finally brought down. Gutman running the ball himself for seven yards on the option play. Ehrman now into quarterback number 12. And the Purdue team fails to gain enough yardage. Notre Dame out in front. Notre Dame takes over on downs. Carey and a backward pass to Washington. Stopped by Neves for no gain. Gaffney now in the backfield of Notre Dame. They using most of his players today. Gaffney will punt. Good kick by Gaffney. Ball rolling dead on the Purdue 13 yard line. Purdue tries a couple plays and then are penalized all the way to the one yard line for unnecessary roughness. Now third down. Evans in slow motion. Laterals to Peters. Peters has it at the eight, the 10. Uses the straight arm very effectively. He's at the 15, cuts back at the 17, moves to the 20. He's at the 22, the 24, 25 yard line before he is finally brought down. Nice play for Purdue. Reichert around right end. And it's nine yards for Mr. Reichert on the play. Out to the 34 yard line. He's their place kicker. Reichert takes the ball behind the line from the quarterback and is thrown for a loss this time, a three-yard loss. Football game is almost history. Notre Dame has their second victory in the bag. Reichert back in punt formation, only seconds left. He lifts the punt high downfield to Keller on the 34. Keller running laterally across the field, trying to find a spot to break downfield. Is thrown hard on the 30-yard line. Only seconds remaining now as they tick off the big scoreboard clock. There it is. The ball game is over. Notre Dame wins by a score of 37 to 7 over Purdue University at Ross Aid Stadium in Lafayette, Indiana.